Hey everyone, welcome to our channel. You already know how AI is constantly bringing game-changing features, right? Well, in this video, we'll be diving into the newly integrated AI generative fill in Adobe Photoshop. Exciting stuff! In the first part, we'll discover the incredible generative fill feature that can extend an existing image on both sides within just a few seconds. Next, we'll showcase the remarkable capabilities of AI generative fill to instantly remove and add objects right before your eyes. In the last example, we will delve into the exciting world of background transformations and unveil how a single prompt can completely change the background. To access the newly added generative fill option, we open Creative Cloud Desktop. The main page contains info about all apps, pricing, and other features. We go to the beta apps to access the Photoshop beta. From desktop apps, you can install the Photoshop beta. Since the Photoshop beta app is already installed on this computer, therefore, we will just launch it. Once the app is launched, you'll find yourself on the main page of Photoshop. Let's kick things off by opening a new project, which essentially creates a fresh and independent workspace. Inside this new window, you'll come across various settings like image size, resolution, and more that can be adjusted according to your needs. For this demonstration, we'll leave them as they are and create a project solely focused on exploring the generative fill tool. Now, the white layer you see acts as the background layer. We'll import an image and witness how effortlessly we can extend it using the generative fill tool. To do this, we'll hide the background layer and use the rectangle tool to select both sides of the image, just like you see on the screen. Remember, to select both sides of an image, simply hold down the shift button on your keyboard. When dealing with screen images, it's crucial to have a slight overlap on both sides of the selection box. This nifty technique works wonders for producing high-quality images. Now, let's leave the text field empty and head over to the toolbar where we'll click on the generative option. Instantly, the image generation process kicks off. Wow, this feature is truly incredible. Just take a look at how the image has been seamlessly extended on both sides, it's absolutely perfect. The mountains blend flawlessly with the original ones, and even the sand and the shadow of the girl have been extended flawlessly. It's amazing. On the right-hand side, you'll notice three different images. You can choose the one you prefer or regenerate the image. Let's import another image and explore the fascinating ability to add and remove objects. We want to remove the lights from the image. Using the rectangle tool, We'll select them, leave the prompt empty, and regenerate the image. The lights have disappeared, leaving the wall looking just like the original. Now, let's get creative and add another element, a cat on the rug in front of the couch. To do this, we'll select the desired area, type cat in the prompt as shown on the screen, and regenerate the image. The regeneration process has begun and typically takes around 20 to 30 seconds. And voila! A new cat magically appears. It's truly amazing what generative fill can do. Before we continue rest of the video, I would appreciate it if you take a moment and hit that subscribe button. Alright, let's continue. Now, let's explore how we can effortlessly change the background of another image by providing just one prompt. To begin, we'll select the object by clicking the corresponding option on the toolbar, as you can see on the screen. Once the object is selected, we'll proceed to invert our selection by clicking the Invert tab. This step is crucial because, without it, the image would be replaced entirely by the prompt output. Now, it's time to unleash our creativity by typing our desired prompt. The prompt can consist of adjectives and objects to guide the background change. For this demonstration, we'll replace the current background with a beautiful flower meadow and see the magical transformation unfold. So, in the prompt space, we simply type flower meadow and hit the regenerate button. And look at that. The background has been completely transformed. It's truly remarkable. Now, you'll notice that there are three options available. You can select the one that appeals to you the most, or hit the regenerate button. Thanks for watching.